Hello, my name is Howard Lake from UK Fundraising and I'm delighted today to be talking to Aaron Simpson of Kindred. Um, hi Aaron, how are you? Hello, very well, thank you. How are Good. you? Good, I am very well, thank you. Do you tell me what Kindred is? What does it do and how does it help charities? Kindred's core mission is a, a, it's a social enterprise that we've started um, with its core mission is to uh, drive as large charitable donations as possible um to charities over forty thousand charities we have on the register um across the uk and us and it does that by slicing off a piece of retail spend so it's got a very clever piece of tech that sits in your desktop or laptop and we're producing a mobile version shortly um that basically takes your donors uh and follows them around the net and when they buy something in a shop it slices off a piece of cash back for them and their cash back um, basically is carved off according to the percentage that they want to give to the charity so they have to give one percent yep. but they can do a hundred percent so if there's ten pounds of cash back you could earn ten pounds of uh, donation in effect um, and we expect that each donor that uses the plugin uh, will generate roughly about 35 to 50 pounds a month for a charity. That's much higher. I was going to say this is a very packed sector. There are lots of organisations doing affiliate and cashback opportunities for charities, but that's a much higher fig monthly figure than I think I've come across um, so far. How, how, how do you manage that? Well, probably because we've got uh, over 50,000 brands involved. So out of the top 250 online brands, we have 238 of them, for example. Wow. Uh, and we're built specifically for this single purpose. So a lot of the people do cash back through websites. Um, uh, so you have to go to their website to go and get the deal. Uh, we don't have one, well, we have that, but uh, it's, it's dwarfed by the plugin. And the plugin has a retention rate of over 88%. Uh, and uh, it's 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 fantastic you know as a tool it sits there and does its job because that's i think been one of one of the big big difficulties of affiliate program is to actually ensure that you remind people when they visit a, a merchant online to actually trigger trigger the donation or trigger the yeah the, the payment does that so does this solve that problem do you think yeah it's automated yeah fabulous so it, John Lewis to Harrods to Selfridges to JD Sports to Nike to I mean yeah I can carry on forever Sainsbury's whatever you want to go Planet Organic Amazon uh, it will collect your cash back automatically and donate it in the percentage that you wish to do to the charity you can change that at any time mm. uh, most people are donating over seventy percent I was going to ask if there's an average that's very high as well that's I thought it might be closer to fifty but that's that's very encouraging well, so that. Either, they either do 20% or 100%, so the average yeah. is... Everything. Okay, fair enough. And how many charities have you got taking part with you? Partner? We are, yeah, I mean, we, we have, I mean, loads. I mean, I don't know an absolute figure on it, mm. but we're talking to, directly talking to around 500, and um, we are out to around 11,000 in the UK at the moment. Yeah. Through relationship with Virgin Money Giving. So if you've received an email from Virgin Money Giving saying, you know, about us, um, click on it. It's all automated. You can sign up automatically. You don't have to talk to anyone, which is a pleasure nowadays. Yeah, yeah. Um, over Zoom. And, um, and, you know, you can sign up. We have some of the biggest charities in Britain uh, about to launch it. Save the Children, uh, RNLI, um, Gosh. Uh, you know, there's a list. So, yeah. um you know, as people realise, as charities realise that the world's gone very much online and digital and, um, you know, uh, the age of sitting in a bath of baked beans may have passed as a sponsored event. Yeah. Uh, yes, there'll always be room for tentpole events, and of course, and people getting actively involved. But ultimately, if we can slice off a piece of retail revenue on anything you do. So even if you're on LinkedIn, you'll get 21% cashback on LinkedIn. Uh, through to TripAdvisor, you get 28% on TripAdvisor. I mean, it's an endless piece of string. So yeah. it's great. Indeed. And we're sort of second week, just about second week of December now. Have you noticed, actually, when did when did Kindred start? Have you got data going back? How long have you got data going back to you? 
we kicked off the plug-in side of the business in August. Yeah. Um, but, but it's been going since March. Yeah, I think I thought I remember it from earlier this we're, year. What we're really good at is utilising influencers um, to drive traffic to um, you know people's plugins. That's yeah. all we're really good at. And so in that case, have you spotted a, a surge over the last month? I would have said normally it would have been December, but obviously with lockdown, November was also a big sort of Chris, Christmas shopping session. Presumably it's, it's going up quite steeply at the moment. Yeah, so it's uh, our, our um, average ARPU rate has gone up from, I think, 28 to, sorry, to, uh, seven, £7.80 ARPU to £28. Yeah, astonishing. Um, I a um obviously help and then you've got of course you've got the sales coming up for boxing day yeah. and the very sales so we're very very active at the moment i think we're getting about four or five charities a day launching the product into their market so yeah. i was going to ask for charities watching is is it too late to make to take part in in christmas at the moment in terms of this how long does it take to to set up oh i i less than this conversation's been two minutes <laughs> five two minutes all, all online a, we have an entire digital marketing pack, everything end to end from Insta to Facebook to Twitter to PR releases, blog releases that we could share and they just brand and curate and send out. Yeah. And it's it's got to be a consistent thing over two or three months. It can't just be yeah. a one -off hit. You're going to one off hit. You'll get a 0.1 percent response rate. Yeah. If it's hit, you'll get up to that five, 10 percent rate, which is where you want to be. I was going to say you also founded another company called Quintessentially. And that's, that's where you've been active. Um, tell me, tell me more about that because I know you set up a, a foundation for that as well. Yeah, so I'm a trustee of the Quintessentially Foundation. We've raised, I think, about sixteen million pounds for good good causes across the years. Um, it's a completely different model. It's very big checks from wealthy folk that we look after in our day to day business. Yeah. Uh, and uh, you know, when I when I came up with the idea for Kindred, I was looking at the model and going, okay, what's the polar opposite of what I've been doing for 18 years? Um, and it's a very successful business around the world, and it looks after some of the richest people in the world. Um, and uh, but that doesn't, it, you know, fantastic big checks for 200, 300 thousand pounds do absolutely move the needle, but they're not consistent. Yeah. No. So the, the Kindred's a consistent model that drives. You know, 35, 40 pounds per month per user to a charity. Yeah. Yeah. And Kindred particularly is different because it's it's not costing the, the supporter anything. So it's no. money that we're going to spend anyway, which is the joy. Correct. So the money goes, money is very simple. The brand obviously pays for the for the uh, transaction, yeah. pays us a tiny fee on the side. It doesn't yeah. affect the end user's cash back at all. So the cash back amount is already fully baked to the user. And then the user decides how much they donate. Um, so it, it's a it, sort of a, as a circle, it's very win, 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 so to speak. Yeah. So it doesn't cost the user anything, doesn't cost the charity. Anything. There's no downside. Yeah. Fabulous. Um, and I know you um, state you're a building or have built a global community of conscientious consumers. Um, how how are you doing in terms of reach so you're operating in the uk did you say us as well or are, are, are you running we have south africa turkey it's quite a random group of countries mm. uh but primarily probably where people, people i know yeah. um turkey we're doing australia and asia next and um it we've got a quite a large test bed going on in south america so we've got a portuguese version and a spanish version coming along um, and it's working with local charities, very much uh, community-based charities, but also the big boys, you know, the, yeah. the World Life Funds and the, you know, um, and UNICEF, et cetera, et cetera, that type of charity level that can do the global campaigns. Um, and I hope that it's something that we will ultimately get on every desktop in the world. Yeah. Fabulous. Yeah. yeah. No global, global ambitions. Yeah, because ultimately every single day hundreds of millions of pounds are left on the table from brands yeah. uh, and um probably billions of pounds actually um it's a 6.5 trillion dollar industry so i'm assuming a one or two of that is quite a lot of money yes or, absolutely uh, yeah. good luck with unlocking that so how can charities how can individuals um try out or sign up with with kindred 
Well, if you want to try it just direct without a, a white label or a co-brand, go to, yep, there you go, Howard, brilliant, way ahead of the Very game. <laughs> you can go and download the plugin. Um, but understand that we can white label that plugin. However big or small you are, we can set you up as your own version of it um, within minutes. Uh, Color coded and use your logo. So wherever you see Kindred, it will start popping up as your brand. So your donors are reminded every time they shop that they're giving back. Fabulous. Aaron Simpson, thank you very much indeed for telling us about Kindred. Pleasure. Thanks for your time, everybody. Thank you. Thank you.